Hi Capricorn, welcome to your reading. This is a general love reading. Let's continue. Let's shuffle the deck four times for you. Let's start with what went wrong in the past. It was a heavy connection that caused you to think a lot about the conflicts that happened. It gave you lots of confusion, sleepless nights, overthinking, and you were the only partner, I guess, that was doing all the heavy work here all by yourself. So not much a team work here towards something serious, but it seems like you were wanting this connection uh, more than them. Now let's see about what is affecting you in your subconscious that you may not be aware of. You want to find that happiness again. It's your main priority right now. With them or without them, you want to be happy, balanced, harmonious again. That's what I'm getting. Now, you don't see much cooperation with them. Conflicts, disagreements, not being on the same page. And that thing makes you very unhappy. So you reflect a lot about the dynamics of the past. Now let's see about the current energies. You're trying to be logical, cold, detached. Uh, you are looking or you want to look at the facts as well, not just the feelings. You have attraction, you have a desire to reconnect with them, but still your logical mind is telling you slow down, look at the facts, not rush an important decision with them. Now, how do you view the situation? You see problems with communication or understanding each other. Uh, it's like you both have your guards up and it's not easy uh, to communicate because there's some fear of misunderstandings, disagreements. It's like being on the fence for arguments each time. You want to move on. I think uh, to give up or not, it doesn't matter. Uh, what matters is that you want more clarity what you want to do with the situation. To wait for them, it's a decision. Or to give up, it's... Uh, to give up is also a decision, but you want to make a decision regarding them. Not just stay posed and uh, in this stagnancy mode. You want to make a decision. What you want to do with the past. To let it end, and move on and find a better new partner or to still hope that things will be resolved and repaired. You don't like that uh, indecision. What you fear is that this lack of openness uh, will continue. With this lack of openness will continue because you see like uh, there's lots of hurt and pain in the past <clears throat> that makes you both not see each other the same again. Uh, it's like the past will haunt both of you in every argument, in every discussion or communication. And that's what you fear, that the relationship may not be the same again even if it was to be restarted. Now let's see about their energies towards you at this moment. Let's hope that uh, it was not a third party situation. For a small minority it may have been the case. Uh, some cheating here or lying behavior with that Seven of Swords and Three of Pentacles reversed. I think this is for a small minority, but take what resonates. Now, what 
I'm getting is that they have this avoidance energy to talk, to communicate the truth. They know that you both cannot work together, cannot uh, talk together easily. And do they have the same feelings for you? Uh, it's uh, They don't want to express feelings at this moment. They are very closed off. They are trying to be cold and detached. But with that Nine of Cups reversed, I see a needy energy. They still feel uh, like something is missing in their life after the, that breakup. But they know that uh, they may have been drained emotionally. Or they may doubt that there are feelings there anymore because I have Queen of Cups, King of Cups, both reversed, so they may doubt. You don't have feelings, so why should they have feelings or why should they express feelings to you? I don't like that much uh, this energy of them trying to avoid telling the truth or they think the truth has been revealed and that's why they should avoid the situation, even for the disagreements. Uh, but they just... They just um, stand there unhappy, feeling like something is missing in their life, but just not wanting to express feelings. King of Cups uh, is reversed. Now, I want to view more details uh, in the extended of this video. First, what kind of feelings do they have towards you? Let's get more details about that King of Cups reversed. Is it that they have feelings? but they don't want to express those feelings because they see you not loving them anymore or they just felt out of love. I, I will also view how do they see you from the outside, what are their intentions for now, what are the mutual energies and what are the energies around each one of you. If you want to watch the extended of this video, you can find it now in the description box below this video. Or if you're watching this from your mobile phone, uh, you can just click the title, the description box will expand, and at the top you can find the extended link. Thank you for watching, see you the next reading, and bye for now.